when they get lifted up, they do a boogie, boogie, like the boogie man. everyone, welcome to my channel, Everyday I'm Mothering, and our 31 days of Halloween STEM activity series. So today we are making dancing frankenworms. To do this experiment, you will need some white vinegar, some baking soda, a couple clear cups, a jug of water, and also some gummy worms. And then you'll want something to move the worms. Now you can just use forks but I like to use these little pinchers, and I actually found these on Amazon, and I really like them, especially for my two-year-old. It really helps them be able to use their pincher technique to pick things up, and I have everything linked down below that you'll need for this whole series as far as a shopping list, and those are included. Then also a spoon, knife, and cutting board. Then the first step is to cut up your gummy worms and you want to cut them lengthwise and you'll want to cut each gummy worm into about four pieces. If you cut them into too many pieces, they will not float as well in your cup. So you'll want to use probably about three pieces per cup, but these can be pretty tricky to cut because they're so sticky. So your best bet is to get your knife wet or to actually put some baking soda on the gummy worms and they'll be a lot easier to cut, but you should get about four cuts per gummy worm. The next step is to add your baking soda to your water and stir it up and then you're going to put your gummy worms directly down in that and they're going to need to soak for about 15 minutes in that baking soda water mixture. Ah, uh, here. Yeah. Nothing's happening. And my girls definitely found a way to entertain themselves for that 15 minute waiting period. Then you want to fill another cup full of white vinegar so you can add your worms to it. What do you think's gonna happen when you put your worm in your vinegar? I think it's gonna explode and Boom. fall everywhere. I think thing. it's gonna dissolve uh, and make uh. the water, the vinegar, turn a different color. like dancing since it's not going up all the way it's just going back and forth it's cool once they go up you look at the top The bubbles are going upward, so the mm. bubbles that are clinging around it are making it go up. But once the bubbles disappear, the thing sinks down. Wow. Uh -huh, but then the bubbles reappear since it goes to the bottom where all the bubbles are clumped and it comes back up again. We know vinegar and baking soda mix together. They call it a dark side. When we got a cup of water, 
and a cup of baking soda and ash worms and we soak them in the water and then the baking soda appeared bubbles and the bubbles lifted it up so got those lifted up and then they sink back down. When they get lifted up they do a boogie boogie like the boogie man. And those are our dancing frankenworms. Make sure to give this video a thumbs up and subscribe to my channel if you haven't already. And check out our 31 Days of Halloween STEM Activity Series playlist. Bye, everyone.